Hey, I'm Sam Edwards. And uh, we participated in the AndevCon Firebase, Firebase and Internet of Things Hackathon yesterday and won first prize. So we're going to show you what we made. Uh, our team's name was Groupthink. And actually, we had two other members, Just so it wasn't just us. But uh, Our team name was Groupthink, and it's a term used in psychology when if one person makes an irrational thought or idea, then other people are more inclined to go with that. So our idea to combat that was an anonymous voting app. So what we've done is we've created a client app on Android as well as an IoT device, which will allow you to, to see the results of all the voting and the, each client app allows you to create a single anonymous vote. So let's walk you through the client app real quick. So we zoom in on this. Um, there's a lot of debugging stuff here, but there's essentially a yes and no button. So each device will get one vote and you can click yes or no and you can change that if you'd like. Um, if so we, that, that's why I suppose what you're sorry. voting for. Basically, right. kind of the title or something. Sure, go, like that. go ahead. Yeah, so yeah. Here you're supposed to have the title, the question, what are you voting for, then yes, no, and then the result, what you voted, and then yes or no, like the total count. Of it. So yeah, we kind of ran out of time with what we were doing, but essentially, this would be something in the middle of the room. Uh, you'd have something you're voting on, you talk about, and when you wanted to vote on the next thing, you'd clear it out and you'd start. So let's, we've got a few people in the room here that can vote. And so yeah. we're all, one of us will vote yes now. I will vote uh, yes. yes. And so we can see there's one vote for yes, zero votes for no. Now I'm going to dis dissent from this and click no. So we'll see we now have a one to one. And we tried our best to do 50 uh, 50. Yeah. But I said, oh, I changed my mind if I vote no now. Yeah, we'll no. And then uh, Jason can pop in and he can be, you're going to be green or red. Oh. oh, somebody cleared the session. Oh, so um, <laughs> All right, so then you have this ability to reset. But now yeah. it's, let's all four go green. Okay, full green. There we go, full and now let's all go no. I will go no. All right, nice. so let's talk through um, kind of how this is happening. So we use Firebase as our backend. Yeah. If you look on the screen here, this is uh, the Firebase console. And you can see right now we have four uh, vote entries. Each one has a Boolean property, vote false, true or false. And because uh, it's, everything... It's a real-time database, so everything is uh, pushed to different devices. Okay, so I'm gonna click next round now, which will clear out everything. As you can see, there's uh, new nodes without votes that were created, and everything else is dropped. I'm going to click yes, which will create one vote for true. So click no one for no. Okay. A no on another device, and you can see it reflects as false. So this is completely real time. If I change it, it will get updated as well. So we can see there's two trues. If you pans here to the device, we can see it's two trues. And I'm going to go no on my phone. So you're starting to trust us that this actually works, except somebody hit clear. <laughs> um, anyway, that's what we did. Um, somehow we ended up with first place, so we're super excited about that. Um, yeah, it was pretty cool. Thank you.